welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from tutorvid.com. This tutorial or comparison is going to check out the content aware fill in Photoshop CS5 and compare it to the previous version CS4. So the cool thing about content aware fill is it's a smarter fill. So in CS4 we have this healing brush tool or spot healing brush and they work quite well. If we for example take a look at the cigarette it removes it but it has a little bit of a problem there getting the right color. If we look at this one over here it uh, was able to do a decent job but if we take a larger example like this pocket on the skirt you can see what happens it replaces it with just a huge blur so that's what CS4 did it wasn't very smart but it worked for little dust spots or little things like this you can fix up alright alright so if we close CS4 and hop into CS5 alright now this is in CS5 if we look at the same deal with the cigarettes here, yeah, you can see it did a better job. It created a little bit of this grate, and this other one is not a problem. And if we take a look at the skirt, it did a mediocre job, but better than CS4. You can still see when it's doing a large area, and there's a lot of other textures around, it has a little bit of a hard time knowing what to replace into it but with a little extra work it can still save you quite a few steps but for actually replacing large elements in the photo like if we want to move this entire person here uh, content aware fill would have a pretty impossible time I'll just select it and get the shadow if I were to press the delete key now you can see it had some hard times figuring out what to do it managed to do this floor quite well but to know what to replace the rest of the person with it was a hard if we try this top guy it actually did a pretty good job it was able to know that it should be drawing a pattern back here on the wall and it got this here window quite well and matched this up quite nice so with that one you could probably even use that and then just use the clone tool and fix this up and that's it a quick look at the content aware fill and how it works check out more tutorials on tutorvid.com